For six months now, Judge Khulud al-Faqih has presided over cases in Sharia courts that deal primarily with cases of marriage, divorce and inheritance. She's one of only two female judges ever to fill this post in the Middle East, and both are Palestinians. The Palestinian judicial system has long had female judges in civil and criminal courts, but observers say these new Sharia court appointments are revolutionary because the issue remains controversial among Muslim scholars. Palestinians entered uncharted territory in the area of Sharia law by appointing two female judges, yet they continue to struggle with an outdated Jordanian law that's 30 years old. Before this appointment, Judge Khulud practiced law for a woman's advocacy group for six years. She agrees the law is outdated, but would rather uphold the rule of law than have none at all. We have a great draft version of the Personal Affairs Bill. It was drafted years ago with the input of human rights organizations and women's groups. But the legislature has so far failed to adopt it. Having a woman preside over Sharia court will help advance justice, but approving new laws is not within my jurisdiction. At the corner of her courtroom, lawyer trainees take notes of every word Judge Khulud says. This was an issue scholars debated for a long time. Our scholars took the opinion of Abu Hanifa. That's very good. Women should have an important role in society. It's only natural. And outside her courtroom, people wait to have their cases heard. Women were especially happy to have a fellow woman break this final glass ceiling. I strongly support the idea of having female judges, and I hope to see a female president one day. At 32 years old, Judge Khulud, who's also a mother of three, won her position as a Sharia judge by beating other male lawyers in a competition. Her appointment has pushed other supreme judges in the Middle East to accept the idea, providing women across the region with new opportunity. Nur Al Jazeera, Ramallah.